Hello, this is Spidey1958, and welcome to my Let's Play Feed the Beast Unleash Plus, episode 38. I think it's 38. I'm not positive on that. Um, I have updated to the release version, actually, the 1.1, I think, is the version of the Unleash pack, which means logistics pipes is now included along with a couple other mods that I was adding extra. The only thing I had to do to make compatibility is this block disappeared and I had to sp spawn in a new one to replace it. Everything else, all the configs seemed to match up and I didn't have any problems. So I was actually somewhat amazed. Well, I have a problem. I have several problems here. One of them is storage. So I think what we're going to do is make a packet stamper and a packet maker, I think it is what I want. And get out of cheat mode. Packet. Craft packet maker, craft packet stamper. I think those are the two I need. So let's go upstairs and uh, see what we can do here. So I'm going to need a dispenser, which I actually don't have in my system. Yet. Oh, no, I don't need a dispenser. I just need crafting table. So let's go ahead and request crafting table. Craft two of those. And piston. Craft two of those. That's interesting. Did it not actually? That should have gone over here. And piston. Well, pistons are crafting. There's one piston. Okay, there's two pistons. We can put them back in there. And next I need crafting tables, which is actually being made by my other system. So we should be able to do this. Oh, cobble. I need to import cobble. What else do I need for that? That should be it for that one. Okay. And iron I need to import. Okay, we got those machines. Okay. So I'm going to need a diamond block, which means I'm going to need. So let's go in here. Diamonds. Okay. So diamond block. And we're going to need one of these. I 
And I thought I had TNT in my system, but I probably need to import it. Yep. There we are. Now I gotta figure out where I want to put these. This is sort of the crafting area down here. Now let's go ahead and put them up here. Well, that's interesting. It actually made the packet for me. I didn't know you could do that. And there we got my diamond charge. Now I think I need iron. Nope, I need another brick. Let's see if we have any nether brick. Oh, I need this. Eh, I only have that, so I'm going to need... Oh, let's make four. I think I can just throw that into my compressor. Well, that's not making what I want. How do I make individual nether bricks? Whoops. Oh, I have to cook him. Duh. So let's get some more nether brick here. Throw it in here. And we'll throw the other ones in here so we have some in our system for future. Okay. So now we should be able to put one of these and one of these together get one of these. Now let's order a stack of iron. And we'll run over here, throw it in our packager. Okay, and let's go make it day. And let's go over here. We have this nice stone area. Get our Wrath Igniter. Oops, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to light that. Okay, we just need to wait for it to go out here. Turn the normal fire. 
put it out. That gives us blocks of dark iron, which we can turn into dark iron ingots. Okay, then what we need for these is the extra dimensional barrel upgrade. So I'm going to need a barrel, some blaze, oh, blaze rods. I don't know if I have any blaze rods left. Let's find out. We know I got that book to a spawner. I got enough to make two of them. That should get me started. Okay, then I need leather. Need two of those. And what else did I need? I need barrels. So I need two of those. And I need an ender pearl. Two of those. Need to actually pick them up, though. I believe all I need to do is right click on the barrels I want to put these on and I should be able to have tons of space. So the primary one I wanted this for is this one. Shift. There we go. Now scrap should be able to go in there. Hopefully. Let's go test it. Because of my power issues, I can't have my mass fab running when I'm doing almost anything else, and I can't do almost anything else when the bees are running. So power is really an issue, too. Where was I going? Is there, did we, no, we haven't got any in there yet. That's good. I should have tons in here. Yep. Okay. So now we have an uh, almost infinite amount of scrap we can store. What else here is close to being full that I care about? Wax is getting close. I don't think there's anything down below that's running full. That I want to carry more than can be stored. Oh, coal. That eh, coal's not an issue yet. And iron's not an issue yet. I guess I can save it. Because I don't really want more than that for dirt, cobble, and uh, sand. So, we can save that for the moment. And let's put this in our valuables. And we'll put this in miscellaneous. And that can go in miscellaneous. Ah, let's throw that in valuables.
And for all our iron, zombie flesh, and sticks in there. Okay. And I'll show you what I was doing off camera. I need to start breeding other bees. So I already put a wintry hive out. We love quantum boots and legs. Is that appetite? Hey, look, there's a. And that's the one of the buildings I found. So let's go ahead and dig a hole here. Put that there. Put that there. Put that there. Put this down here. Set it to send only, quarry, check. Okay. And I'm already getting stuff out of it that I don't really want. Okay. Oh, do I have... Yes, I have a scoop in here. Yay! Is that appetite? I believe that's appetite. Not much appetite, but something I don't have a whole lot of. Oops, looks like a world hole's opened up. Let me fix this. One of the many obsidian gates left over from the problems with the uh, enhanced gates mod, which they have since removed. Okay, now we need to build something new that I haven't built before. Uh, so first thing I'm going to need... Now let's go up to our other council because that's easier to build stuff up. Do, 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 do. Don't pink. So... I'm going to need a chunk loader. Oh, I need one more diamond. Okay, that gives us our enchantment table. Well, gold. Oh, let's make get twenty gold, ten gold up here, and ender pearls. Oh, let's get ten of those up here, and let's try this again. Okay, that gives us our chunk loader. Now, what I want which is why I got the other extra ender pearls, is spot loaders. These load a single chunk.
Okay. Because those hives are only, I only need a single chunk loaded for them, hopefully. I can move them if I, that's not the case. Okay. So over here I got my wintry one. Hi sheep. Into the water. Ah. Okay. See if I can remember what key I set it for. Chunk loaders. That looks like it's just barely in a chunk, but it's in a chunk. So we're going to go ahead and put down a single spot loader right here. And we can see that this chunk is loaded. Now let's go let's go ahead and turn those off because they take they really lag me. I was thinking of uh, since logistic pipes is now a regular part of Unleashed, I was thinking to do a couple quick little tutorials on some basic systems you can build with logistics pipes, like uh, versions of my sorting system and that. So let me know if people have an interest in something like that. Okay, looks like that's good. Wow, that's barely in, but it's in. Okay, so those are taken care of, and I got more pollen. I keep getting random pollen for some reason. I'm not sure where it's coming from. I thought you could only get pollen using bees. Okay, let's go for these miscellaneous little two dads in here. And we'll throw well, let's throw the pollen in the bees for now. Oh, I'm getting lots of silk wisps. That's good. Royal jelly, pollen, and lots and lots of honeydew, which I don't have a whole lot of use for. Okay, let's see how we're doing on time and figure out what we're going to do next. Okay. Oh, I didn't. Some of you may have noticed as I walked by. Do, 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 do. Well, that's right. I wanted to show you that. Do, do, do. If you remember this stuff that I couldn't figure out what it was for, I have figured out what it's for. If I eat it, 
it gives me experience and I had a lot of it so I've been enchanting books I know there's much better things to enchant but uh, books are what about enchanting so up here I built a vanilla enchanter and ignore that that's feeds uh, charcoal into my furnace below <laughs> I just didn't have enough room otherwise and efficiency 4 that's not bad so I'm basically growing experience not tons of it but I am growing it and I think I'm out of room in this chest Uh, let's go ahead and I don't need a wooden sword anymore and let's get rid of some bows oh, and I don't need this anymore okay there we go And let's go check. I've been trying to breed lapis bees because they're the next one in the progression I need for the uh, emerald bees I want to get. So let's see how if my breeder's having any luck. Well, it looks like that bee still hasn't died. That's the original bee, maybe. Let's see what we got. Yeah, it says it's pure water. I may have lost my mutation. It's only a 5% chance to get lapis. It's one of the harder ones. And I can't remember. I did get teak trees. So I need to chop these down after I get a few more saplings off them and start working on balsa and let's go out here and check oh my apple trees grew yay these are orchard apple trees which are supposed to produce a lot more apples and can be grown in an orchard and my other uh, walnut tree grew yay so let's go see how I'm doing on uh, apple should go in here ah, and I'm getting yep I'm actually getting ahead on apples because this keeps a uh, whoops ah I keep a stack in there and apparently my fruit juice is full it should be okay because I got tons and tons of mulch there yep fruit juice is full why are there cans in here why am I getting cans of fruit juice I don't know oh I know why these engines ran out at one point maybe I don't know must be some reason I'm making cans of fruit juice and this power is not completely discharged but doesn't ever get fully charged anymore I turned off the cows breeding and I think at this point I'm gonna go ahead and call it an episode and that um, as always if you enjoyed this episode go ahead and give me a like or a comment I do appreciate likes as it can get me more views and uh, if you dislike the episode, leaving a dislike is fine. But please leave a comment saying what you disliked. 
Um, someone had commented that no one does world downloads again anymore. I do do world downloads whenever it's an even 10. So episode 40, which is coming up, I will do a world download again. Now you will have to import my configs and the extra mods, though less mods than before, since logistic pipes and that are all part of the newest version of Unleashed. So um, also people have asked about, I had talked about starting a SMP series. I do have the technical hurdles um, solved in that. I will be using Unleashed, the latest version of Unleashed with no extra mods, just exactly the way it is out on a server. Uh, the main issue now is getting scheduling time with the other person I'm going to do it with. Um, I've also thought of doing, I found a new city building challenge for Feed the Beast that I'm thinking of doing as well. And there's yet another a uh, server that I may play on if it gets off the ground for YouTubers. So all of those are possibilities, but at this point I don't have any real schedule. Uh, mod episodes should be out fairly regularly for a while. I've actually got a break in my uh, busy schedule, so hopefully I'll be able to get mods out to you guys a little bit more regularly. Though tomorrow night Tomorrow I don't know if I get a mod out because tomorrow I get to go see myself on the big screen. The film I made last weekend is premiering in uh, theaters for part of the 48-hour film competition. So. so anyway, as always, this is Spidey1958, and have fun Minecrafting.